Shalom. Let us say our praises due unto Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shem Peace and bless the whole for members of the elect. This in regards to uh, a footage I saw, you know, of our people, um, you know, the things that we had to suffer as a nation, you know, during the transatlantic slave trade, man, you know, through, uh, you know, West Africa, you know, Santo Me and certain colonies, you know, where, uh, you know, we fell, you know, from our state, you know, our uh, great state, you know, during, um, you know, basically, uh, the renaissance you know which means that rebirth you know and the renaissance art where they whitewashed our 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 images you know because prior to the renaissance art you know everybody knew who the israelites were all right because uh you know like like you were able to see it you know all over europe you know and uh basically uh you know the devil you know um with um alexander alexander um the pope you know of rome right and uh the borgia family they funded that and, um, yeah i'm gonna make you guys play this because this is um this is real man and uh end of the day like you, you like you devils man you, like you're not gonna get away you know from your judgment man you know it says uh though hand joining the hand the wicked is, is not gonna go on punishment so even though a lot of our people they're very docile and they're kissing the white man's ass but end of the day you're not gonna get away from this man you know from this judgment that's gonna come Let's play this quick. Things that I'm picking up. These are 400 years old. From Ghana. Hand restraints. Neck restraints. And ultimately, uh, we fell, right? And uh, our people you know the Ashanti kingdom and certain kingdoms of west africa was involved in the uh, atlantic slave trade the downfall of our people you know and uh you know that's why that's the scripture in deuteronomy 28 so like, yeah. Deuteronomy 28, verse 54. So that the man that is tender among you and very delicate, his eye shall be evil toward his brother and toward the wife of his bosom, toward the remnant of the children, which shall be, which shall, which shall leave, right? And, um, you know, that's pretty much what happened, you know, the trial and the slave trade, you know, the Portuguese were involved, you know, and, um, uh, you know certain west african kingdoms right which are we know we're you know the kingdom of uh benin all right which have been um uh, important stronghold the kingdom of uh Benjamin, right? Benin. So, um, I don't know. It's, uh, the kingdom of Wuda or Judah, right? So, e Esau knows, man. This is on Wikipedia. Kingdom of Winda known as locally as uh but also known as spelt in original litter no it's like a old 
literature as uh, Huda, Widda, Uda, Uda, Winda, or Judah. And that's exactly what they were, right? You know, like the Roba, you know, this, uh, you know, a tribe of people. You know, a lot of them are uh, located in um, Nigeria and, and um, you know, a whole bunch. It said it, it, it was a major slave trade area which uh, exported more than 1 million African like, to the United States and Brazil, right? You know that Brazil is, uh, is a very uh, strong... Uh, you know, like population of our people, you know, it's one of the, after the United States, like Brazil is the, is the, is a, a greatest, uh, a great, uh, land, you know, that, uh, the Portuguese, uh, have conquered, you know, um, so yeah, let's, let me go back to this, so this is Deuteronomy 22, verse 24, let's look at the, um, the translation comparison. Let's look at the comparisons. This is the NKJV, Deuteronomy 28, verse 54. The sensitive and very refined man among you will be desolate toward his brother, toward the wife of his bosom, and toward the rest of his children, whom he shall leave behind. All right, so they're in the China land of slave trade, man. And uh, says that the NLT, the most tender, tender-hearted man among you will have no compassion for his own brother, his beloved wife, and his surviving children. Right? Because we were uh, ultimately, you know, that we would go into captivity, you know, to the transatlantic slave trade. All right, which uh, a lot of our people played a strong uh, role, you know, through it. It's the kingdom of Judah. So you look at the map. The kingdom of Benin and all that. I'll look at those ancient maps. So let's play this again. For educational purposes, man. All right, so these chains that I'm picking up, these are 400 years old from Ghana. Hand restraints, neck restraints. So that's 35 pounds. Right. Oh, man. That's just crazy. You know, and I'm, I'm holding these for the second time, and my heart is still beating out of my chest. It's like, it is, is, I don't know, there's a connection that when you pick them up, it's you feel every bit of the anxiety that your ancestor felt when they were put on him or her. Mm-hmm. And this thing, they didn't know where they were going. And they didn't, they didn't know what these chains were, where they were going, why they were being put on. Um, Sit down, Bob. What's, what's the name of the Straight from the It's gunshot straight from the hip. Uh, yeah, so, uh, you know, that's what we, that ultimately happened. Let's get Deuteronomy 28, verse 68. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships, right? We know that 
you know, this place, you know, we went into Egypt, you know, during, uh, you know, when we were uh, in captivity, you know, 430 years of captivity in the land of Egypt, you know, and, uh, you know, Moses, he, he, like, delivered us to the, red, you know, like, through the sea, you know, um, the Strait of uh, Akbar, you know, and basically, uh, you know, like, we would always go back and forth to Egypt, all right? So this place is spiritually Egypt, or right? America, all right? Because that's why we have, um, you know, um, you know, basically what um, uh, Benjamin Franklin, you know, he was like, uh, he was a great, um, you know, he's, he's a person who knew the maps and, you know, um, you know, um, the architecture and stuff like that. And basically, uh, he built, uh, you know, a place that would be, uh, you know, that shows you that we're in Egypt, you know, basically, you know, when you look at the dollar bill, you know, with uh, the pyramid, you know, the all seen eye Horus and all that, that's basically what, uh, you know, that's basically, uh, you know, what, you know, the elite have, uh, you know, have, you know, and, um, you know, so it shows you that, um, you know, that the witchcraft, what these people uh, do, you know, and um, basically, yeah, I said, the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships, by the way, whereof I spake unto thee, that thou shalt see it no more. So, yeah, so we're not going to see our land, all right, because uh, ultimately, you know, from 70 AD, you know, we are fleeing from Roman persecution. So a lot of our people came, you know, into uh, North Africa, you know, and, um, you know, and eventually going deeper into the West West Africa, all right? And uh, basically, uh, we all, that you know, like we were, uh, we will fall, you know. It said, it said, thou shalt see it no more again till... And there you shall be sold unto your enemies for bondmen and bondwomen, and no man shall buy you. All right, that's what we did. Because we transgress against the Heavenly Father. This Deuteronomy 28 and 1. Did it. And it shall come to pass, if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy power, and observe and do all his commandments, which I command thee this day, that the Lord sh Thy power will set thee on high above all nations on earth. So the Lord, uh, if he will uh, obey, you know, Yahweh Shai, you know, if he will obey the, the, the Heavenly Father, ultimately, you know, you know, we would have been uh, good, you know, but uh, ultimately, uh, you know, that like we had to fall, you know, you know, as a, as a nation, you know, so that we could uh, appreciate, you know, like the struggle or you know basically and um you know and basically like you know we're hoping to obtain the tree of life you know where we could live forever you know and all these things and all these blessings shall come on thee and overtake thee and if thou shalt hearken unto the voice of the lord thy power this you know but when you go into 15th verse it says uh but it shall come to pass if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy power to observe and to do all his commandments and his statutes which I command thee this day that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee and that's what happened you know as a, to us you know as a nation because we uh, transgress against you know the laws, statutes, commandments, you know, where, you know, by worshiping idols, you know, committing adultery, you know, doing all kinds of things, man. You know, so the most I, uh, he cursed us. All right, so we're living under the curse, you know, of, um, of Deuteronomy 15 to 68. All right. So with that, let us say praise is due unto Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai, the ones of the apostles of GMS. Peace and blessings to the hope and members of the election.